Good evening and welcome to another edition of the McGraw Report. I'm Harry McGraw, your host, and today we're going to talk football today. Are you ready for some football? Well, today we're going to be talking about the Chicago Football Classic. Now, this is a favorite of mine every year on the McGraw Report. The, the, the Classic is one of those institutions here at the McGraw Foundation. We love to support this event. It's a fantastic event, and we have a bunch of guests for you to talk about it, so I want you to get your pens and papers ready because it's time for some football. And we have here from uh, Sherman Dodge, uh, the lead sales manager, Mr. Ron Collins, is here as our guest on the McGraw Report. And uh, he's one of the uh, contributing sponsors of the Classic this year. And we're excited to have him. And we want you guys to call in, 312-738-1060. You want to check out some football this year? Come to the Classic. We got some big-time football going on this year. And so I want to thank you, Mr. Collins, for coming on the show. It's great to be with you. Good and, to be with you. And, uh, you know, your sponsorship to this event is huge. Uh, I understand you guys have been supporters for, for many years. And uh, we just want you to chime in and let us know what you think about what's going on this year. No, we're, we're just excited to be a part of this event. We realize that education is foundational to the quality of life. And uh, this event in particular gives focus to the HBCUs and the idea that uh, we are looking for the pull through in our community. Our young students have dreams and aspirations to college. And this is a perfect opportunity for those dreams to become a destination. And the events of the week, the college fair, expose our children to both community and culture on a platform of education. So the opportunity for growth and, and goal setting and achievement is rich throughout the week. That is fantastic stuff. You know, um, I love those cars you guys are selling, by the oh. way. Those charges are some of my favorites. Awesome. And I know these kids out here looking at these cars and they they're do. looking at football and they're getting all excited. <laughs> and I yeah. understand that you guys got a special raffle that you're doing oh, this we, year we do indeed. at the event. We do indeed. You know, we, we have the benefit of selling to our students' parents in many instances. And the idea of driving a new Dodge, Jeep, Chrysler, Ram uh, gives them a great opportunity to gain mobility throughout the community and, and the ease of movement throughout their activities. But what really happens is you get excited when you see that new car. And we'll be offering a car at the, um, at the Classic and available through Raffle where we're going to give away a new Challenger, 2012 Challenger. Oh, yeah, I love yeah. that Challenger, man. It gets everybody excited. Yeah, it's an awesome piece of machinery. It really is. All right. Made in America right here in Chicago. Absolutely. We're talking about the Chicago Football Classic here on the McGraw Report. Give us a call, 312-738-1060. You want to win a charge? You want to go to the game? You want to check out the festivities? Give us a call. We're going to talk to you about what's going on today in uh, Chicago when it comes to the Classic. Uh, uh, we got a call on the line? Okay. Well, we're going to pass on that caller. But before I let you go... Um, I understand this is the 15th year of this classic. 15th year of this event. What a showcase. Wow. And, and a showcase where students, again, have a chance to see uh, the opportunity for tradition, uh, the many fraternities and sororities that are part of the rich HBCU culture. And what a great way for them to celebrate, celebrate 15 years, 15 years of football, 15 years of family community and success within the community. I love it. I love it. Chicago is a great football town. I think the Bears got a chance, but if you've never been to Soldiers Field, this is your opportunity to get in on a great event. We do it every year. It's a big time event. It's a lot of great people involved in it, and we want you to get in on it. We got a caller on the line? Okay, we're going to hold that caller. Now, also, I want you to tell me, who's playing this year? Oh, we have uh, our friends coming in from Albany State and from Kentucky State. And uh, they'll be able to knock heads in front of a, a full house, we hope, Saturday. Uh, this coming Saturday, the 29th, I should say, at Soldier Field. So it'll be a big-time contest, and there'll be a lot of entertainment wrapped around. And I understand that there's some real competition at halftime. Wow. Now, you know, Albany State, uh, Kentucky State, these are historical Black college, universities, yes. HBCUs. HBCUs. And I, I, I love the fact that we're getting all of these young African Americans together under yes. one umbrella doing something positive. And, Indeed. And, and, and with the you know school uh, strike finally ending, people are getting back to the business yes. of educating our kids. Yes. And, and that's what's up. Give us a call here at the McGraw Report. 
312-738-1060. We're going to try to keep this kind of tight today because we have a lot of guests, but we want you to know that we are on Can TV. This is a hotline show, and you can also come in and uh, give us a call, 312-738-1060. Call us, uh, and we'll, we'll, we'll fill you in on what's going on, you know, with the Chicago Football Classic. This is one of our favorite shows and we do this every year, and we want to thank, you know, Sherman uh, Dodge of Skokie for coming on the show and being a part of uh, the classic. We love the fact that they're involved in this classic. It's a big deal. And now, you know, we have Miss uh, Miss Audrina Spence. Miss Audrina Spence is uh, one of the participants of the classic. Also, she she works with uh, the families. Uh, Big time. There's a lot of families that's going to be involved uh, in, in coming to the classic, which this is a family event, right, Miss? Yes, Ms. it is. And so um, tell me your role in working with the families. Well, my role is I am uh, the executive director for Metropolitan Family Services. Uh, I am a member of a civic organization, Jack and Jill of America, and I'm a mother. So my role is because I started going to the classic years ago with my own children. And so I knew the value and importance of making sure not only that my children experience it, but other kids as well. Um, especially those young people who wouldn't have an opportunity to go on college tours who, who are first generation possible college students. Mm -hmm. So that was the value for me is that we have to provide exposure to ins higher institutions for our children. And this is a great way at home to do it. And for most kids, it's the first and only time they'll get to Soldier Field. So now they get an opportunity to experience uh, HBCU. Mm -hmm. They get a chance to experience the camaraderie of going to college. And now they get an opportunity to think about and plant dreams for themselves about going to a uh, post-secondary institution. Yeah, I, I think that's great. Now, Ms. Spence, you know, Jack and Jill, I, I know ever since we've been covering the classic, Jack and Jill has been an active member of the classic, bringing, uh, you know, busloads of people to the game. How many people you got coming this time? You well, breaking a record this year? Well, let me tell you, this year for Jack and Jill of America, Chicago Lynn Chapters, it's about four chapters, mm -hmm. and we are bringing, uh, right now we're at 500. We're still selling tickets, so we're trying to top it. Last year we did 700. Wow. So we are, we, it's still early for us. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. So, and then Metropolitan, Metropolitan is at 600. So uh -oh. we are, our goal is to keep raising those numbers because we know the more tickets that are purchased is the more individuals and families that get a chance to experience this great event. Chicago, get your tickets now. I'm telling you, if you want a seat, you better get your tickets now. We're looking for you out at the Chicago Football Classic. It's coming up. Uh, the game itself is September 29th at 4 o'clock p.m. So you can plan your Saturday out with a lot of events. There's a lot of things that are going to be going on uh, around Soldiers Field that day. And it's not just about football. It's about education. Yes. It's about family. And uh, it's about, you know, having a good time, right? That That is correct. So, you know, come on out. Check out the game. You're going to love it. Now, I also know that they're going to have a battle of the bands, right? Now, how do the kids respond to that? I, I, I used to love mm -hmm. uh, those battles in high mm -hmm. school when, you know, the game is kind of breaking and then you get the two bands out there. And, you know, it's nothing like a historical black college band. I mean, we don't do it like, you know, the little pom-poms and, you know, mm -hmm. just the state. You know, it's, it's some real serious dancing going on. Yes, it is. And that's interesting because I went to a Big Ten campus. And so I had a sister who went to an HBCU. And mm -hmm. I can tell you, every year I made it to homecoming <laughs> to experience that because it's nothing like it. Nothing so like I it. So I wanted my kids to have that same experience. And when you see the young people that experience that, mm -hmm. this is drumline in Chicago. So, mm -hmm. and for most, this is the only drum line they're going to get a chance to see at this point in their lives. Mm -hmm. But the goal is out of this that they're going to be kids that's going to go to the college fairs, that's going to be at those games and say they can see themselves on that field and on these edit at these institutions. That's and right. meaning institutions of higher learning. That's right. And you know, right now, with the job market being the way it is, we need to promote education now more than ever for our kids. You have to get a good education if you want to make some good money, you want to buy that nice house, 
You want to buy that nice car. You want to live good. You want to mm -hmm. be able to take care of your family the way you're supposed to. Get a good education. Start a business. Have a good career and enjoy your life. And this is a way to do it the fun way. You can go to college. Go to a historical black college. Come out to the games. Enjoy the football. Enjoy the battle.